What's up, everybody? It's your boy Ooch. I'm here with my brother Ooch, and we are back once again. How y'all doing today? Nailed it as always. <laughs> What's going on, everyone? It's your boys back again for yet another reaction episode ten of Bleach. We are finally in the double digits, and uh, you know I'm pretty sure. I think we said this last week, but. These episodes are not stopping as far as we know. So we're just going to keep getting these cores. So which I'm sure after episode 13, we might actually see another song. Mm. That's basically what that means. So we'll see like opening two, opening or ending two, whatever. I'm just hoping that as if the songs change, that they're still good. They got that shit in stock probably. I I hope. <laughs> I, that's, always, that's always one of my worries with any new anime or just anime in general is that whenever there's like a new like part mm -hmm. and they change the songs up i'm just like oh like it better it better be as good or better yeah e. yeah so without further ado guys let's just get right into it. He blacks out in the <laughs> middle of battle, bro. This is like a rematch of the century for him. Yeah. Yeah. Like last week we got a taste of how like Mans doesn't want to die until he's able to like, I guess, defeat Unahana. Right. <laughs> She's the original Kimpachi. <laughs> Dude, that is so sick. Like I remember when I read that chapter, I was like, what? Bleach had the, the twist. The, the crazy part is, what is her name? Unahana? Unahana, yeah. Unahana. She didn't even fight the the peoples that came through. No. Because they, they had her hidden type shit. Yeah, pretty much. Which is crazy because... We don't even know how she would have done. She probably would have cut a couple of them niggas. And got cut. Yeah, I feel like... Yeah, that's weird because you'd think, like, in a situation like that, you'd want to, like, you know, throw Unleash out all everything. your... Yeah. But I guess that's just another... I guess that's just another way of them, like, in a sense, even in the middle of war, they're, like, showing constraint, which is, like, kind of ridiculous, but, you know, it is what it is. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, oh, also, guys, if you are enjoying these reactions and you want to actually see, you know, this visual a little bit better, I am putting them on Patreon, so head on over there and become a patron so that way you can actually see how these are supposed to, but, you know, until Japan decides to allow people like us to just react normally like you know for trailers then this is how things have to be so go ahead and over to the patreon page link in the description below mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <clears throat> oh yo look at young bull kempachi you saw that shit episode 10 i've heard nothing but good things about this one too the battle Several hundred years ago. Yeah, they're old. That shit crazy. Yeah. <laughs> Man, like a hundred. <laughs> mm. She killed all those people. Oh, wait, maybe she didn't. Oh, that was Kenpachi. Oh, shit. <laughs> it's always like this in anime. <laughs> Wow, he got her when he was young. Mm. B 
because of that battle, that's why he put nerfs on himself? <laughs> this man is OD. Wow. Restraining his powers, bro. This is insane. <laughs> At that young age, that's insane. What? Bro, he's broken. Mm. <laughs> what the fuck? Wow. What? Yeah. Wow. So she's going to keep killing him until he wakes up for reals. Oh. What the fuck? Okay, that's nasty. What? What's her shit, bro? We're about to find out. Mm. Oh, she crazy. It's always the crazy bitches. Oh, oh, she got the she got the quick heels. Oh damn, shit. yo, he's cool. I'm yo, she was right about him. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? Oh my god. Is he really like? Half burnt? Nah. <laughs> I was about to say.
Yo, it's like they're talking mentally. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hmm. That's insane. Wow. Damn, so that's damn. Hmm. That's they can only have one campache at a time. Shit. Wow. So the, is is he gonna get her bankai? Is that how this works? Since there will only be one Kimpachi? Wow. I, I, I figured this was going to happen. But shit. <gasps> Yo, is that his sword? Is that his Zanpakuto? I think so. Yo, <laughs> oh, my get a fucking... <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna be so broken with a bankai. With a bankai. Yes. Then I can say it. I figured. Mm, then I can say it. Because I would do that shit. Because they're that's supposed to be he like he'll know, and then when it's time. He's gonna say it mm -hmm. when when it's his next fight, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and we gonna see this man looking <laughs> bankai. Let's go. Oh yeah, the disco guy. Or is he a rock star? Oh, he creates the Zompak toes. <laughs> what the fuck? 
What the hell? I bet you those are all swords. How much want to bet? If he makes if he makes Zanpakuto, I bet you those are swords. Though all those girls are swords. Oh good. Oetsu Nimaya. Blade God. <laughs> I like him. <laughs> Head first. <laughs> He's funny. <laughs> Who the hell is this? Oh the hell? She just kicked his ass. Holden. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Damn. What? I uh, fucking yo, I told you. I told you. Oh, the call outs. Oh, that's their swords. Wow. Mm. Oh shit. Hmm. You don't make swords for losers. A Sauchi. The nameless Zampak <laughs> Toe. Wow. Mm. Damn, that's that's pretty cool. A personalized actually. design yeah. pack, though. They're crying. Damn. Yeah. That's Get it. Shit about it fucking end. <laughs> yeah.
They was they they they, they were giving us a lot to work with there, yeah, so I figured it was about time. Damn, that was that was a fucking fire episode. Yeah, no, it was pretty good. You know, no letdowns. It was action for half of it, and then like even, I mean, the Ichigo fucking part is is getting somewhere. Yeah, like now they're now the next episode is gonna be personalized around them probably and fucking them rebuilding their zompactos and stuff. I feel like with their fight in that pit, they're gonna have to basically like out loud confess to the those all those nameless ones like certain things that might trigger them to like they're gonna they're gonna probably have to get all of those to side with them and then when he sees that the the zanpakuto creator he's gonna be like okay i'll fix your shit he's probably nah yeah i could already kind of first see what you're saying yeah yeah basically ijigo and renji are probably gonna they're gonna confess their feelings on how they use their zanpakuto's probably to protect the ones they love and all that right it's probably gonna get deeper so well yeah and then that's what's gonna make make man's fix their zanpakuto or or just recreate a new one from whatever the fuck yeah yeah i don't know yeah looking forward to that john oh we get a little after credits what 71 hours Ichigo failed? An emotional limit. Renji is a soul reaper and you are not. <clears throat> wow. No Don't go to Soul Society ever again. Come on. This might be part of the test. Mm. Damn, he said don't make for a mm. for a fake soul reaper. Just like that? Mm. Oh, he must learn his roots first. What the heck? He just he just sent them somewhere. He sent them back home. Like dead at like quite literally? And literally. You without sin are like the sun. Okay. Everything but the rain. Okay. Well then, sheesh. Well, that was That was crazy. <laughs> the fuck? That adds <laughs> a lot more layers to what we thought this episode or what next week was gonna do bro ain't nobody thought that ichigo would get fucking sent home 
or wouldn't get picked. Yeah, and I don't by even an remember ultimate that. Fucking Zompak, though. Well, yeah, I mean that 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 makes an interesting makes for an interesting conversation because honestly, like, you know, that part is clear where he makes a connection with Renji, that like, yeah, Renji, you're clearly a Soul Reaper, so after like nearly three days of them fighting all these Asauchi, like it's probably more it's probably i feel like it's probably just more natural for someone like renji to i guess attract another one but then for ichigo there's something about him that's really not clicking because then again i mean at the end of the day he was always a like substitute, a substitute so. shinigami or so yeah so but yeah i feel like this is gonna obviously be a part of his lesson even even if man's told him he's never allowed to come back you know he's gonna come back yeah because they need him right like like they're just i don't know i don't know it's it's interesting but confusing yeah no like it's it's it can be confusing because like why at a time like this would they do that but then i see why they would because it is important for them to understand certain things if they are to really maximize and optimize their chances of beating you or something you know and the rest of the stern readers and uh it's kind of crazy i don't i don't honestly know if he actually got sent home like i feel like he, oh I you, feel okay like i see he, what you mean i feel like he he put him in like some type of illusion or something for him to find his roots for him to then bring him back when, right. he, when he oversees it because the what what's the what's the dude's name like the soul reaper king or whatever oh yeah yeah yeah, yeah the soul reaper king like he, the soul reaper king understands ichigo's a special case talent, like a special case special talent or whatever so for this dude to make a decision for him not to come be, like say all this shit basically trash talking them doesn't make sense it's a part of the process. It's a part of the process, but yeah. it's an interesting take for sure. Yeah, it, we didn't see this. Uh, I mean, I wouldn't have seen this coming. Yeah, I totally forgot about this part. So, like at that rate, what really it comes down to is that Renji essentially like passed the 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 proper way, but now Ichigo is just kind of taking a detour or back around to because I remember, remember the first guy that they that with the with the freaking with the onsen like when they were in the freaking like the the hot tub ship yeah like he admitted when they were gone that like they're special and that he got hurt when he hit them type shit so like they are unique in their own way and obviously they are like chosen ones in their own right especially ichigo of course um and there's some other things that i don't think they've fully explored yet which i'm still holding on to which is it's a big thing that i'm pretty sure they haven't exposed in the anime and i i'm i'm not gonna say it only because i know you haven't read the manga obviously <laughs> and 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 clearly since there's there's like a but so many things that i do remember like i don't even remember kenpachi fighting unuhana like i don't yeah, right i don't rem i don't remember that shit, but i remember him being involved but the fact that this happened like that was that was fire so this but the but this big thing with ichigo like that you don't forget so like i'm just wondering if we're getting to that point and i'm hoping some of y'all in the comments are picking up what i'm putting down because <laughs> you know i'm trying to also preserve a lot of people that might be watching these reactions um you know that are not manga readers or that you know read it like before like i did but either way um episode was dope yeah so that should be it again um look forward to any of these like raw reaction videos on my patreon page the link will be in the description below if you want to see like the actual visual and you can hear it a little bit better um other than that i hope you guys are enjoying what you can make of these reactions and uh we're gonna continue to react to them look forward to the next episode next week episode 11 um anything at last you got for the people at home nah okay all right well like share subscribe hit us up um make sure you guys are taking care of yourselves may the power protect you locked right here on this channel stay safe stay clean stay safe. i'll see you guys next time